Just over a week ago, secondary and tertiary level schools in the country reopened to start its new school year sessions. And in just a few days, the public primary schools will resume classes for the school year 2014-2015. It is a time when a lot of children and sometimes even parents are excited and eager to begin gathering supplies. Because it means shopping. It means the smell of new items like school bags and shoes and exercise books. But while preparing for the new school year can bring some excitement, it also brings expenses. Love News recently did a few interviews downtown Belize City to find out just how parents and guardians are coping with their children's educational expenses and how much they will be spending this school year. When we add up everything, I'll come up to like almost like three thousand dollars, like two to three thousand dollars. That's including tuition and books and everything. I have a child, the youngest going into infant two. Uh, my other son going into second farm St. John's, and I have a daughter doing fourth farm at Palote. How much money are you estimating you're going to be spending in tuition, back to school supplies, and uniforms for your three kids? I would say between three thousand five hundred to four thousand five. As soon as school closes, that's the more important part. Cause earlier shopping better. You look wrong first. Cause you just can't go buy a for stretch of money. For quite some time now, the Ministry of Education has boasted on many occasions the three hundred dollar subsidy that is offered to students on the secondary level. We asked the parents who were willing to talk to us if they are taking advantage of the ministry's offer. Too much procedures and I guess um, they were asking uh, like a lot of questions so we decided like personal questions and I we pre prefer not to go into that. The Ministry of Education has been announcing for some time now that they actually offer a $300 subsidy um, providing that you apply for it now. Have you taken advantage of that? Of course we have. It has worked well from both my, my two oldest children. It's, it's, it's still a little help. Oh, no. well, I don't know about that. <laughs> nope. With the demand at its peak for school uniforms and stationary supplies, we went around to find out what sales have been like and what offers are being given during this back-to-school season. We have uh, all kind of variety of uniforms. We have for both primary schools and high schools and preschools also. When it's ru rush hours, we usually give a person a uh, discount of 5%. We have the little jumpers then, they are here for 20, 22, 25, it all depends on the size. And like the high school ones, we have them for 40, 45, 50, like I've mentioned, all depends on the size. Every 50 mil and ending, we have 15% off all school supplies in the stores, 10% daily at all school bags, and especially on the John Sport school bags, we have on all transport, uh, year warranty. So if you purchase a school bag today, this year, if anything happens to it, we'll replace it within the year. According to statistics dated for the school year 2012 2013, there are 213 preschools, 294 primary schools, 52 secondary schools, 10 junior colleges, and three universities around the country. Reporting for Love News, I am Renee Trujillo.